We thank the Lord for His mercy is upon us. Deva Namil Kanvi Kirakangal Kangandi Sulatu. He has given us yet another day to come together in, thy ho in the house of God. Deva Day Vitle Marbudim Marudar Kanga Varnali Devan Koti Kurtrikra. You know, we have come to also hear what He has to say to us. Even today. We have a God who is concerned about our lives. You know, He wants to speak to us. He wants to reveal Himself to us. He wants to tell us why He saved us. He wants to tell why His Son shed His blood and died on that cruel cross. He wants to tell us why his son shed his blood and died on that cruel cross. Hidden in the ages past is being made known unto his holy apostles and prophets. You know, so there are things that the Heavenly Father would like to speak to us and reveal to us concerning his Son. And all that is in and through His Son. You know, we are not and And we thank God for what the Lord began to speak to us from the turn of this new year. We are grateful to God. For uh, helping us to turn to the book of Haggai. Wherein the Lord made one thing very clear. That it is time for his house to be built. It is time for his house to be completed. And uh, we also saw from the book of uh, from the book of Ezra. How the people of God gathered as one man in the right, right at the beginning to build the house of God, to rebuild the house of God. You know, and we know that it was the seventh month. The month of the Feast of Tabernacles. And we thank God for all that the Lord began to unfold to us. You know, and we heard the importance of revelation. The importance of knowing things by the revealing power of the Holy Spirit. We saw that the Lord will bring God's people into an organic oneness and unity. And we know that is very necessary uh, for the building of His house in these end times. We also heard very clearly how important it is for God's people to know the times in which we are. You know, once we know the times, then we know what we ought to do. Many a time we do not realize the time in God's purpose. You know, uh, what God wants to do in this hour. No, this is very important. 
But many are in a place where they think that they have been born again, they're baptized, they're spirit filled, and one day they will go from here. There is no knowledge and understanding and a Holy Spirit imparted revelation of their salvation in Christ. You know, we heard about many things. Many, many things. You know, we heard how this oneness is going to be brought about. But I would like to share something again today morning. Uh, uh, you know, introductory word about the great need of revelation. You know, as I did last week, the Lord is laying this upon my heart that it's not enough merely to hear what God is saying, but how we hear. It's very important. That's what Jesus repeatedly said. Both in the Gospels and also in the book of Revelation chapters 2 and 3. He that hath an ear, let him hear. What the Spirit is saying. Very, very important. No, we need to know many a time we conclude we hear by the Spirit. Just, be, just because we are sincere, just because we are born again, you know, to hear by the Spirit is yet different a thing. And may God help us. Now before I turn and move on to our subject, you know, I would like to share this again to all of us. You know, when, when we saw, when we read the book of uh, Luke chapter 24 Luke, last week Luke, I want to turn us to that scripture again Luke 24 Luke, yes Luke 24 verse 24 and 25 yes let's turn to that again and we saw verse 44 and he said unto them to his disciples these are the words which I speak unto you I speak unto you while I was yet with you. So remember, the Lord had spoken these words to them. I, well, I was yet with you. And I said that all things must be fulfilled which are written in the law of Moses and in the prophets and in the Psalms concerning me. The Lord says, I have spoken to you this. Not once, not twice, but many times. You heard me. And you said, yes, I heard. And you said, Lord spoke to me. These words in the Vartagal, which I speak on Nanungalkusana Vartagal concerning Yenne Kurti Elder Kravigal, all those things must be fulfilled. Yella Karim Nerever Vendum, but their eyes were not open. Analam of the Kanga Treka Padaville, they heard our little Kate Argal repeatedly. Palamore Kate Argal, they responded our little Pradutram Tretin Argal, and yet. Irindalum, their eyes were not open. They were troubled about what happened. Yes. You know, and the Lord had to ask them, Why are you troubled? Why do your thoughts arise in your hearts? You know, so I would want to encourage God's people. I want to encourage myself. You know that we need the Lord to open our understanding. 
the darkened understanding of ours our darkened minds of ours must be opened nammude irulana manadhu therakkapada vendum he gave them the power to understand the very things they heard they responded avargal kettu prathithram selathiya andha karyangalai purindukollumbadi devan avargalukku manadhai therandar yes you know so i would like to say this again to all of us agave ellorkum marubadiyum solugiren yes we need this work of the spirit in our lives nammude vaalvilum indha aaviyude kirivai namakku thevai you know so i would like to say here again agave marubadiyum naan solla virumbugiren you know we must receive this registration by the spirit within us namakullaga irukkira indha kaaryangalai aaviyil moolamaga padiyai veithukolla vendum yes though they heard it avargal kettalum they needed an illumination by the lord himself in their lives devan thame prakashikka vendi avasiyam avargalukku unda irundathu as we have been here nam ketkolugiradhu pole we are living in this end time nam indha mudivu kaalathil vaalgirom we heard the feast of tabernacles must be full full kudara pandike nichayamai niraivera vendum ennu nam kettom we need to know the times of the fulfillment they are here நாம் கேட்டோம் அந்த நிறைவு இங்கு தான் இருக்கிறது you know saints god is seeking in this age பரிசுத்தவான்களே இந்த முடிவு காலத்திலே in this end times இந்த முடிவு காலத்திலே he is working அவருடைய கிரியை in order to extricate a people from this world இந்த உலகத்திலிருந்து ஒரு கூட்ட ஜனங்களை பிரித்தெடுப்பதா இருக்கிறது a people for himself தனக்கென்று உண்ட ஒரு ஜனங்களை எடுக்கிறார் a people in living union with him avarodu kuda orumana pattu vaalgira oru janangalai pirith edukkar and a remnant in and through whom god's purposes may be fulfilled devude thirumanam oru kootta janangalul niraivera vendum endru pirith edukka virumbugar now this got to be beyond a natural acceptance and a hearing you know uh, uh, and become a revelation uh, an understanding by the illuminating work of the holy spirit in us agave inda karyangal edho oru manadin puridal oru arivin puridalaga irundhu vidakoodadu aavir moolamaga namak unartapatta idu puriyapada vendum yes and we need the illumination of the holy spirit aaviyanudaiya prakasham namakku thevai the lord jesus said to them i i i spoke this to you idhai ungalukku naan solli irundhen endru sonnar that all these things must be fulfilled inda ella karyangalum niraivera vendum endru sonnar yes You know so it's very important brothers and sisters. அதவேன் தேவ ஜனங்களே இது மிக முக்கியம். You know and we know this is God's will. இது தேவ சித்தம் என்று நமக்கு தெரியும். Concerning his church. தன்னுடைய சபையை பொறுத்தவரையிலே our people must enter into that fullness of Christ. கிறிஸ்துவுடைய நிறைவுக்கு ஒரு கூட்ட ஜனங்கள் பிரவேசிக்க வேண்டும். The church must come into the realm that she is without blemish. and without any wrinkle and spot sabayanadhu karai nirayetra parishuddhamum pilayamatra oru sabayaga irukka vendum enbadhu deva siddhamagum you know and god will fulfill devan adhai nichayam niraivetruvar you know we can trace through the word of god nam veda vasanathile aaraya mudiyum and see how much that satan is set against this purpose of god indha deva siddhathirkku ediraga satan anavan edirthu nirkiradhai nam paarkirom we can see how the enemy is set against right from the beginning aarambathilirundhe aadikaalathilirundhe satruvanavan idarkku edhiraga nirkkirathu right from the beginning aarambathilirundhe aadikaalathil we can trace this through the word of god deva vasanathile idai naam aarainda ariya mudiyum and we can see the the uh, the animosity avanudaiya anda pagamaiye paarkka mudiyum the the hate anda veruppai paarkka mudiyum that the enemy brings about and the satruva avan kondu varugiran that which god wants to do devan seiya virumbugira karyangalil how he stands up against it eppadi avan ediraga nikkran endru paarungal how the how the prince of this world brings the world against god and god's people inda ulagathin adhipathiyanavan devanukkum devanudaiya janangalukkum ediraga ulagathai eppadi kondu varugiran endru paarungal the antagonism and the avanud the animosity and, and the and the pagaimai virodham the hostility and the virodham satruta bhare kari yes 
So one thing we need to know that old serpent who is called the devil as we read in Revelation chapter 12 you know he, he has not abandoned his object. He persists. And that's why we read in the book of Revelation 12 they overcame him. That old serpent called the devil. You know he has not abandoned his object. He persists. He persists continually right on in seeking somehow and some way by force, by deception or by subtlety to gain and entangle God's people with this world. Yes. Satan uses the world. You know, he wants God's people to be entangled with the world. And this explains the whole history of the church and of the people of God. When we look at their continuous spiritual battle, when we look at the continuous spiritual battle, yes, the spiritual battle of God's people, uh, the, the history of the church, one thing we see, it has been so much with the world. Yes. So much with the world. The world against God's people and the church. And we are able to read through the history of God's people. How many have fallen back again into the world? Yes. Back again to the world. Because of the strength of world's enticements. Yes. Yes, world's allurements and the glory that is in the world. Yes. You know we see that. How God's people, God, the, the saints of God, the church has fallen back into the world, gone back into the world. The church has again and again fallen into that entanglement. And when we read the scriptures, that is how the apostolic age was closed. Yes. You find that, you know, in the scriptures, when we read the book of Revelation, the seven churches in Asia Minor. You know, where we see the church represented, the universal church represented, seen in the seven churches, except for two exceptional cases we see the rest of them were entangled again with the world remember they were bought by the blood of Christ under the hands of the early apostles in and through the true gospel of Jesus Christ through the valid ministry and the work of the Holy Spirit. And how we see that these churches were entangled again with the world. Yes. <coughs> you know, 
and all this tells us idu ellam enna solugirad enil the great emphasis adrudaiya valiyurthudal enna venil the great need amongst us namakku ullagir kaanapadikira thevai enna venil in these end times inda mudivu kaalathile for a revelation oru velipaattin avasiyam thevai and understand oru puridalin avasiyam thevai and moving on oru thodarchiyana munnetram in our salvation nammudaiya rakshippile thevai to come into the 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 great potential that is in the blood of christ yesu christ nudaiya rakshathile irukkira mulu alavu vallamai pettu kolla vendi alavil varavendum the utter separation that god is calling his people onto tanude janangalai endu vidamana mutrilumana oru pirivu kalaikkirar adile varavendum we may come into that subject a little further innum nam thodandu dhyanikkalam now what i would like to therefore say is the need for a holy spirit imparted revelation as we began agave aaviyanal aaviyanavarnal unarthapatta oru velipaattin avasiyam namakku thevai now i would like to uh, bring to our uh, our our consideration this morning agave nammude sindhiye or karyathirku thiruppuvom once again abraham marubadiyamaga abraham nokki nam paarkalam yes is an example for us adhu namakku or udharanamaga irukirathu yes in abraham's life abraham in malvile we can see the great movement of god devanudaiya kriyaye nam paarkka mudiyum you know toward having a people unto himself from this world indha ulagathilirundhu thanakkendu or janathai devan thedugirar endradhu abraham in vaalkaiyil paarkalam that example that truth we can see in the life of abraham abraham in vaalvil irukku udharanathil irundhu indha satyathai nam paarkka mudiyum listen carefully agave gavanamai kelungal we always appreciate life of abraham eppozhudhume nam abraham in vaalvai paarattukrom but we do not understand the principle of god that was in operation in the life of abraham abraham in vaalvile devan eppadi kriya cheyadaro andha neediyai nam paarkka thavarukrom we appreciate abraham abraham in nam paarattukrom we want to be like him avarkol irukka virumbugrom you know but we do not see the principle of god anal devanudaiya neediye pramanathai nam paarkkiradillai god's movement devanudaiya kriye you know in the life of abraham abraham in vaalvile eppadi seyalpatta or god's work in the life of abraham devan eppadi abraham ile seyalpatta is also a work that god would like to do in you and me ungalilum ennilum adhe maadhiriyana kriye devan seiya virumbugirar it's not an isolated example there in history edho varlaatile thanipatta oru udharanam adhu valla god was at work in a man oru manidhanile devan kriya seidukondirundar that work and that movement is also a picture of how god can work in a people who could be separated from this world unto himself and the kriyaanadu deva janangalin mathiyile devan kriya seyade apdiyaga oru pirikkapatta oru janathai devan kondu varuvar endradhai kaanvikkira oru udharanamaga irundathu yes oh may god help us to understand agave idu purindukolla devan namukku udhavi seiyattum how often we have seen the life of abraham evlo umri nam abraham we appreciate we related ourselves adhe paaraati irukrom nam but somehow you know we were not able to come into that realm of a spiritual illumination to see the move and work of god in his life is an example for us and to be working in us today அப்படியாக இருந்தாலும் அபரகாமின் வாழ்க்கையிலே தேவன் எப்படி கிரிய செய்தார் என்பதை நாம் இன்னும் சரியாய் பார்க்கவில்லை அப்படியாகவே தேவன் நம்மிலே கிரிய செய்ய விரும்புகிறார் என்பதை நாம் புரியாமல் இருக்கிறோம் என்பதை நான் சொல்கிறேன் ஏழாம் அதிகாரம் Here are the words of uh, Stephen. Stephen eppadi aga solugirar? You know we read here in verse 2 chapter 7 of Acts. Apostle nadapadikil 7th adhigaram 2nd vachanam. And he said men and brethren and fathers hearken. Sagodare pidakale The God of glory appeared unto our father abraham acts chapter 7 verse 2 apostle bible 7th adhigaram 2nd vasanam the god of glory appeared unto our father abraham 
when he was in Mesopotamia before he dwelt in Sharon. He said unto him, Get thee out of thy country, from thy kindred, and come into the land which I shall show thee. Then he came out. Then came he out of the land. Now this is a scripture we have read so many times. In the book of Genesis here and in the book of Hebrews and so on. So we he read very clearly. That God of glory appeared unto Abraham. When he was in the Ur of the Chaldees. You know and the reality is. The God of glory appeared unto Abraham. So there was a revelation of the God of glory. Yes. You know that appearing. Instantly had a work in his life. And what was that effect of that glory? He immediately left the Ur of the Calvary. And came out of his country. Yes. You know the terms and the basis of his coming out is so striking. Yes. You so striking because there was no detail given to him. To the land which I shall show thee. That's all the Lord said. All that the Lord said to him was unto a place that I will show thee. And he went. As we read in the book of Hebrews. Let's just turn to that for a moment. Yes. Hebrews chapter 12. Hebrews chapter 12. We have seen that many number of times. Even last year in our meditation. But let's just read that. Yes. By faith Abraham when he was called to go out into a land which he should after receive for an inheritance. He obeyed. He went out knowing whither he went. He went out. So the instant effects of what he saw was that he went out not knowing. Yes. He went out. Not knowing whither he went. You know, and that very clearly represents the spiritual experience of God's people. Spiritual experience. Anubhav. Yes. Yeah. It speaks about the spiritual experience. Yes. This represents. And when God spoke. When God revealed himself. They obeyed. They obeyed. Yes. Now this is very important. This represents the spiritual experience of God's people. 
Yes. You know, very largely, and in a certain way, or in a certain way, or in a specific way, God's people are a people who would say they are called don't know people. Deva Janangal Ariada Janangal Indre Aleke Padigargal. Yes. They are a don't know people with an inverted commas. Avergal Engelke Teria the end of Tolikra Janangalaka Pargal. Yes. I remember this. Are people who have seen and known the call of God in the world they are a don't know people. Yes. Are they telling the could be called a people don't know. What does that mean? They cannot interpret themselves to the world. Yes. They cannot interpret themselves to the world. Yes. They cannot explain their goings they are living in terms of human wisdom. Hmm. Uh, uh, is, is you know, in terms of the human wisdom, we cannot. You and I cannot explain our life, our goings, our living, our decisions in terms of the world's wisdom. Listen, listen very carefully. We cannot explain it away according to the world's understanding. Yes. According to the world, the life of God's people may look to be most foolish. Most unreasonable. Yes. We need to understand. This was the life of Abraham. Yes. The world would say, it, was, it is unpracticable. Or, sorry, unpractical. They would say that this is unpractical. This is altogether contrary to common sense. Yes. How could a man leave his people, his country, not knowing where that place is. Unpractical. Unpractical. Altogether contrary to common sense. Abraham left the Ur of the Chaldees. And if somebody would ask, where are you going? What was his answer? I don't know. What do you expect to find there? You said, God has shown you a land. He has spoken that he will bring me to the land. What, do you, what are you going to find there? What would be the answer of Abraham? I don't know. Well, what are you going for? 
Well, I've been told to go. எனக்கு சொல்லப்பட்டது நான் போகிறேன் என்று சொல்லி இருப்பார். I've been told to go. நான் எனக்கு சொல்லப்பட்டது. That's all that I know. இது மட்டும் எனக்கு தெரியும். And that is not the way of the world. இது உலகத்தின் வழி இப்படி அல்ல. But the scripture says. ஆனால் வேதம் சொல்கிறது. Not knowing whither. தான் போகிற இடம் தெரியாமல் போனார். Yes. You know so we need as i said when you look at life of abraham we see a move of god a work of god abraham in walkey paarkumbolude devudey karathin kriyaiye na paarkrom avar which god would like to apply in the lives of god's people adhe vidhamaga than deva janangalilum devan inda kaariyathai selpadutha virumbugirar and his life very aptly expresses and defines our spiritual life nammudi aavikuriya vaalkai abrahamin vaalkai telivaga vilakkugirathu endru paarkrom the experience of god's true remnant in these times inda kaalathile devanukku meendirukkira janangaludaiya anubhavathai appadiye vilakkugirathu yes but the reality is aanal unmai enna venil abraham had a wish abrahamukku oru darshanam undayirundathu that's important adhu miga mukkiyam I've heard people quote Abraham. Abraham, I pay here. I know you know. You know they had. They were praying. God showed them something. Abraham, just to tell the devil, I don't want to come with you. And they went. Abraham, go on, Abraham. And brought shame to God. Devil, go on. I'm not the one to kill Abraham. So there are people who take the example of Abraham. Abraham, you don't want to come with me. I don't want to come with you. But God had nothing to do with what they did. I know. I'm not going to say that the devil can do or can't do it. Oh may God help us to understand. இதை புரிந்து கொள்ள தேவன் நமக்கு உதவி செய்யட்டும். Abraham had a revelation. அபிரகாமின் இடத்திலே ஒரு வழிபாடு உண்டாயிருந்தது. A vision. ஒரு தரிசனம் இருந்தது. And it had an impact upon this man's life. அது இந்த மனிதனுடைய வாழ்க்கையில ஒரு தாக்கத்தை உண்டு பண்ணியது. you know all kinds of extraordinary behavior ella vidamana asadharana nadaimarigal you know that we see in his life was all because of what he saw avar paarthadin vilaivagave avade vaalkaiyile valla ella kaaryangalum nadandathu endru paarkirom according to the world ulagathai portha varaiyile it was an extraordinary kind of behavior and lifestyle adhu oru asadharanamana vaalkai muraiyaga irundathu Yes. And the reason for that Adrude kaaranam enna venil was that he had a vision of the God of glory. And the magimiyin devanudaiya darithanathai avar kondirundar. You know so in all that idellam he went through in his life. Avar vaalkil kadandha sendra ellam he was sure of one thing. Oru kaariyathil nichayithirundar. And that is Adhu enna venil and that is of god adhu devanal undagiyathu god himself devan thame endru unarndirundar he is sure that he is moving under the divine guidance avar oru deiviga oru valinaduthile poigirar endru avar thannil nichayithirundar he was under the working of god devanudaiya karathin kriyile avar selpattu kondirundar he himself could not understand avaral thannal purindukolla mudiyama irundhalum he could not interpret and share it with the world outside velile irukka ulagathirkku avar thannai velippadutha mudiyama irundhalum remember he himself could not understand avar thane puriyamal irundhar endru purindukollungal as we heard last kadantha varam kettadhu pola god himself is the interpreter devan thame badal kodukiravar adai purindukolla udavi seigiravar and so we see in the life of abraham and abraham in walkil nam paarkirom you know things were not easy with his life avade walkile kaaryangal elidai kanapadavillai he was coming from one bewilderment to another one oru thigaippilirundhu onnoru thigaippirkku avar poi kondirundhar things are becoming more and more difficult kaaryangal adhigam adhigamai kadinamai irundhathu difficult to understand purindukollave kadinamai irundhathu 
impossible for explanation vilakuvatharku megavum saathiyam mattrada or kaaryamaga irundathu yes and if you ask abraham for an explanation abraham nidathe or vilakathai ningal kettal of the variety of experience he went through appadi palavidamana anubhavathile kadandu sendirpadai kurithu kettal yes and what it means to his life avare vaalkai kadai enna artham endru kettal what will be the answer of abraham abraham udaiya badhil enna vaaga irukkum i don't know enakku theriyadhu i don't know enakku theriyadhu all i do know enakku therindadellam is that god has told me devan enakku sonnar avulave and i have to do naan தொடர்ந்து I don't know. எனக்கு தெரியாது. And yet deep down within. இருந்தாலும் அவருடைய இருதயத்தின் ஆழத்திலே there was a subtle thing. ஒரு காரியம் நிச்சயிக்கப்பட்டிருந்தது. And that subtle thing was the great conviction. அந்த மிகப்பெரிய உணர்ச்சிதலே அந்த மிகப்பெரிய நிச்சய தன்மை. That he is on a spiritual ground which is unshakable. அசைக்க முடியாத ஒரு ஆதிக்குரிய அசிபாரத்திலே அவர் இருந்தார். அதுதான் காரியம். that god has appeared to him devan avarku darshanam aayirundar yes and so when we look at his life adhe avade vaalkai naam paarkumbolude he is a man spiritually an outsider of this world aavikuriya vidathile avar ulagathil irundhu piramba irundar spiritually outside of this world aavikuriya vidathile ulagathil irundhu he is a man spiritually outside of this world aavikuriya vidathile ulagathil irundhu piramba ai kaanapattar Yes. Even outside the intelligence of this world. இந்த உலகத்தினுடைய அந்த ஞானத்திற்கு புறம்பாய் இருந்தார். Outside the wisdom of this world. இந்த உலகத்தினுடைய அறிவுக்கு புறம்பாய் இருந்தார். Outside the understanding of this world. இந்த உலகத்தினுடைய புரிதலுக்கு புறம்பாய் இருந்தார். Yes. He is outside. அவர் புறம்பாகவே இருந்தார். He cannot be reckoned amongst those of the people of the world in the ulagathaarodu kuda avar thannai kanakil eduthukollavillai how true when god said about israel israelai kurithu devan sonnare lo a nation oru desathai paarungal not reckoned by the nation and the rajyangalinal angikarikkapadal lo a people who dwell all alone aniyaga vaasam seigira oru jalaluya amen amen lo a people who dwell all alone thaniyaga vaasam seigira andha janathai paarungal a nation not reckoned among the nations andha rajyangalinal yetrukollapadala look at that that principle was not just for israel it began with abraham andha niyadiyanadhu israelil irundha aarambikkavillai avargamilil irundha aarambithadagum amen may god help us to understand this agave devan dear brothers and sisters idai purindukolla udavi seiyattum abraham was outside of the world abraham ulagathirkku puramaga irundar outside of the world's intelligence ulagathinudaiya arivaartha thanmaikkum gnanathirkku understand puridalukkum puramaga irundar he is outside avar puramaga irundar he cannot be reckoned amongst those of this world inda ulagathin makkalodu kuda avar thannai kanakil eduthukollavum you know when you are outside the world ningal ulagathirkku puramaga irukkum bolude and its wisdom avar gnanathirkku puramaga irukkum bolude its intelligence avarudaiya arivukku puramaga irukkum bolude Remember one ஒரு காரியத்தை உணருங்கள் Abraham could not be judged by world standards Abraham உலகத்தினுடைய அந்த நடைமுறையினால் அவர் Even so you and I நீங்களும் நானும் அப்படியாக When you are outside of this world உலகத்திற்கு புறம்பா இருக்கும் பொழுது You cannot be judged by the world standards உலகத்தினுடைய தரத்தினால் உங்களை யாரும் ஒப்புமைப்படுத்த முடியாது He cannot be explained according to this word ulagathin and the valimariyodu kuda nammai oppittu he cannot be vilakave mudiyad he cannot be explained according to this word ulagathin padiyaga abraham elam even so it shall be about his church appadiyagave sabayam kanapadigirathu his church cannot be explained according to this word ulagathin padiyaga sabaye nam purindukolla mudiyad they are outside of this avargal ulagathil irundhu puramba irukkirargal 
and remember it was all because of a revelation idu ellam anda velipattin nimittam da yes god imparted revelation devanal kodukapatta velipattin nimittam agathan yes this is our need today idu dhan indrai thevai namakku i want to say this again to alavai marubadiyum naan solugiren though the lord spoke to the disciples seedargalukku devan pesi irundhalum they heard it adhai avargal kettargal not one oru murai alla many number of times palamurai kettirundargal in those three and a half years and moonre varangalile but analum they understand it was not open avudeya puridal therakapadamal irundhadu they were troubled avargal thondara vadaindargal they were discouraged avargal soru vadaindargal when all the things happened about jesus christ jesus christ ku nerndha kaaryangalai paartha bodhu thondargal he suffering avargalude paadugal he is dead avudeya maranam even his resurrection avudeya veerthaladalum kuda they were troubled about adai kurithu thondara vadaindargal though they heard avargal kettirundhalum adai kurithu they did not understand adai kurithu avargal puriyaamal irundhaal you know therefore i would like to say again this morning aagave inda kaalai padile solugiren we need to understand naam purindukolla vendum what we hear naam kekkira kaaryangal must end up in a revelation adu ore velipaattile mudiya vendum it must end up in an opening of our spiritual eyes nammudaiya kangal therakapadukira oru mudivile adu kaanapada vendum so i want to say this morning before we move on in our meditation nammudaiya dhyanathai todarum vagile solugiren we must be open naam therandu nichayamai kaanapada vendum you know don't conclude even today's after today's message indriya thedik appuram neengal moodi vida vendam that god spoke to me this devan idai enodu pesinar god encourage me with this devan idai uthaga padithinar but remember that anu unandu kollungal all that we are hearing is bringing us to a revelation an understanding of what god has purpose for your life and mine nam kekkira ella karyangalum devan thanudey sithathile ungalkum enakkum enna vaithirukkar engira oru velipaattil kondu varugiradhu you know so as i shared even last week agave naan kadandha varam sonnen the 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 message today is not the end indre seedi indrodu mudindu viduvadillai but this message is to take us in the direction of god's purpose anal indha seedi anadhu devanudaiya thirumanathinudaiya valil kondu varavendum it's unfolding what god has for his church in these end times ivigal ellam devan indha mudivu kaalathile thande sabaiki vaithirukkira andha disaikku namai kondu poga vendum and let's be open to the spirit agave aviyanarukku therndirupo whatever the spirit would nudges cleanses provokes challenges Let's be open to those things. Aviyanu ko namma kena soli grara, urcha ko pati grara, thundi grara, unarthi grara, illa avatrikum thirandhi kana padu. Yes, but remember, like Abraham of old, we are moving on in the purpose of God. Anna unnu kari unandu kollengal ande palayar pat abirgamai pola devude sitte thale. You know, so in our lives we cannot interpret everything to the world. Anna ve ulaga thirikke nam illa avatrikum solla mudi adi. You know we cannot uh, tell the world everything make the world understand about why you do certain things ningal sila karyangalai seigiradhai kurithu inda ulagathirkku ningal puriya veikka mudiyadhu the world will not understand ulagamum purindukollaadhu as we heard kettadhu pole may god help us to understand idhai purindukolla devan udhai that god is extricating a people from the present world that they may be a people through whom god's purpose may be fulfilled devan inda ulagathilirundhe deva janangalai pirithedutte avargalin moolamaga devanudaiya sittam neraveram endru virumbugar endru purindukollungal let's not say i have heard it naan ketta endru solla vendam let's not say i have been hearing it many years alaiya anangalaga kekkira endru solla vendam but the question is anal kelvi enna venil have you seen it by the spirit avinal paarthirgala endru da is there a holy spirit imparted seeing avinal kodukapatta paarvai irukkira that will bring us to that life adhan inda jeevanukku namai kondu varum that separation and the pirivu you know that oneness and the orumai that we will continue to live according to the time in which we are apdiyaga todarndu nam inda mudivu kaalathile todarndu apdiyaga nam vaalvom so we thank god for all that the holy spirit had spoken to us aga vyavi avanar pesi ella kaaryangalukku nandri seluthuvom you know we heard very clearly from god's word devu vaarthil inda miga telivai nam ketom how the spirit of god will bring us people into that oneness through the power and efficacy of the blood of christ yesu christ in rathathinudaiya and the vallame nimithamaga eppadi deva janangalai orumai paattil kondu varuvar endru kettom yes we heard the power of the blood is primarily its incorruptibility and the yesu christ in rathamaga anade aliyada maasatta ratham endru nam kettom 
Yes, the Lord will bring his church into the full potential that is in the blood of the Lamb. It's not an, a, a oneness by agreements and it's not a, a, a oneness by association and a doctrine. But people who have come into a revelation and a knowledge and understanding of that atoning blood of Christ in fulfillment of the day of atonement. Yes. The blood, the precious sinless blood has to come in and deal with sin in our lives. The power and the ground of Satan in activity must be dealt with by the sinless power of the blood. Yes. That means the accusation or the part of the enemy is dealt with. So, the blood has to be operative in our lives, in the life of his remnant in these days. As we heard even last week, the overcomer stands on the ground of the perfection of Christ. Yes. God's remnant and overcomers will meet the accuser by faith's appropriation of the blood of the Lamb. And what is the meaning of the blood being applied? It is that which is absolute sinlessness of the Lord Jesus, that is the ground. That is the ground. Satan has nothing to point about that blood on which we stand, that ground on which we stand. That gives us the authority and power over the enemy. The essential perfection of Christ. That being the ground of our confidence and our faith. That is the ground of our trust and our testimony. Remember, we can never face the enemy in our own strength. Now, some of the things that I say may sound very basic. But we need to know that this is the ground on which we can ever stand. We can never stand on the ground of ours at any time. We look at uh, Revelation 12 and when we read verse 11, they overcame him by the blood of the Lamb, by the word of their testimony and they loved not their lives. No, nothing was on themselves. It was on the ground of the Lord alone. If we stand in ourselves, we are defeated, brothers and sisters. There is no perfection in us. There is nothing in us. Whatever that can be, 
that can stand against satan சாத்தானுக்கு எதிராக செயல்படக்கூடிய பரிபூர்ணம் நமக்கு இல்லை bring him to his defeat அவனை தோற்கவிக்க கூடிய வல்லமை நமக்கு இல்லை bring him to defeat அவனை தோற்கவிக்க கூடிய வல்லமை நமக்கு இல்லை that we can bring him to defeat அவனை தோற்கடிக்க முடியும் என்கிற சக்தி இல்லை there is nothing in us நமக்குலாக ஒண்ணும் இல்லை there is nothing in us namakulaga to deliver us namme vidudile sey namakku onrum illai from his accusation avude kutta chaatil irundhu velivira namakku adhigaram illai there is nothing in us namakulaga onrum illai that that can deliver us from his accusation avude kutta chaatil irundhu vidudile seyya namakku vallame illai yes it's very important idu miga mukkiyama nothing in us namakkil onrum illai it is only the ground of christ adhi christuvinude athibara maatrame so when we stand in christ adhi christuvil nam nerkkum bolude in all the perfections of his nature avarude subhavathin paripurnam so how he do sinthai the nature of being absolutely sinless avar paavam illada irundha andha or thanmai which is represented in the blood that was shed for us namakaga sindapatta ratathile kaanapatta andha paavam illada thanmai there is deliverance ange vidudalai undu so though it may be very basic agave idu mega adipadiyaga therindha remember unandukollungal god's people remnant in this end time must come into a deeper acknowledging of this truth and living by it inda satyathai deva janangal aalamaga purindukonde idanal avargal vaala vendum endru naan solugiren you know that is how the blood become operative appadi than inda ratham anadhu jeyam kolikirathu seyalpadukirathu yes becomes active adu kriya seya aarambikirathu operative adu kriya seyalpada aarambikirathu in our daily life nammudaiya anudina vaalkaiyile ratham seyalpada aarambikirathu and it is a great thing idhu oru miga periya karyam to acknowledge the perfections of the lord in a practical way in our life nammudaiya vaalkaiyile christuvinudaiya paripoornangalai ellam nammudaiya vaalkaiyile anudina nadaimurile kondu varuvathu miga periya karyam meet all the accusation of the enemy in our life nammudaiya vaalkaiyile satanudaiya ella kutrachaattukkum edhiraga jeyam kolvathu as we read in revelation 12 velipadithesa 12th adhigaram the accuser of the brethren is cast down avarude kutrapadithukavan keela thallapattan the accuser of the brethren is cast down avarude kutrapadithukavan keela thallapattan yes who accused them before god day and night avan devanukku munbaga avargalai iravum pagalum kutram saatikondirukkiran yes and how could they do that avargal eppadi adai seiya mudindathu because they were not now standing on the ground of their own avargal thangalude sonda palathile nirkavillai not on the ground of their own imperfection thangalude andha kuraibaatin adipadayil nirkavillai not standing on the ground of their sinfulness thangalude paava thanmaiyile avargal nirkavillai not standing on the ground of their weakness thangalude balavinathile avargal nirkavillai not standing on the ground of their faultness thangalude pilaiyin nimithamaga nirkavillai faultiness thangalude pilaiyin athibarathil nirkavillai yes but they standing on the ground of his absolute perfection avarude paripurnathinudeya andha ella paripurnathin athibarathil nindargal yes the word of their testimony avargal saathiyude vaarthai the word of their testimony and avarude saathiyude vaarthai the word of their testimony is adhu enna vendral that is blood is sinless avarude ratham paavam illam irundathu adhu dhaan the word of their testimony is avarude saathiyude vaarthai enna vendral that his blood has no sin christuvin ratathile paavam illai adhu dhaan and he has washed us avar nammai kaluvi irukkar and that blood is able to wash us and the ratham nammai kaluva vallamai kondathu amen there is victory for me enakku ange jeyam undu so it is only on that ground we can ever have victory against every accusation of the enemy agave andha oru athibarathin nimithamagave naam satrivinkku munbaga eppozhudum jeyam kollugalaga kaanapaduvom the absolute holiness andha muttilumana paripurna the abs you know not in ourselves nammile kaanapadadathu irukirathu but in him anal avarile kaanapadukirathu and we need to appropriate it by faith idai naam andha viswasathinal nadaimurai padatha vendum we need to apprehend it by faith naam viswasathinal pidithukolla vendum both are necessary rendume mukkiyam 
we need an apprehending by faith vishwasathinal nam adai pidithukolla vendum we need an appropriating by faith vishwasathinal adai nam nadaimurai padatha vendum rendu mukkiyam that the lord jesus yesu christu vanavar in his essential being nam avarude bhoomi kuriya vaalkaiyile is a spotless lamb of god avar and the maasatra aattukuttiyaga irundar deva aattukuttiyaga irundar he is a spotless lamb of god avar maasatra deva aattukuttiyaga irundar for us namakkaga from us to god nammai devanukkum yes and from us or for us to god nammai devanukku neragavum yes and from god to us devanidathirundu namakkum kodukkapatta aattukuttiyanavar yes that is the ground of victory adhan jayathinudaiya asthibaram the lord has given the lamb devan namak kaattukuttiyanavare kodutha and it is through the lamb unto god we stand and aattukuttiyanavar moolamaga devanukku munbaga nam nirkirom yes now that is very important we need a spiritual light and not a mental understanding here idhu miga mukkiyam namakku or aavikuriya velicham thevai arivu saarndha puridhal mukkiyam alla yes so as i said there is an appropriating by faith agave viswasathin moolamaga nadaimurai padatha vendum and there is an apprehending by faith viswasathin moolamaga pidithukollavum vendum that the spotless lamb of god and the maasatra deva aattukutti is for us namakkaga unto god devanukkendrum and he is from god unto us devan namakkaga kodutha aattukuttiyagavum that is the ground of victory edidan and the jayathin asthibaram if we give the enemy nam satruvukkaga one little fragment of the old adam and the palaya manidanudaiya palaya vastrathe konjam koduthalum kuda yadhi ee bhoomi satruvu devilla or of the flesh to the enemy and the satruvukku maamsathe konjam koduthalum kuda or the self nammude suyathai kaanvithu koduthalum to the enemy edirikku koduthalum he immediately takes avan udanadiyaga the place of power in our life udanadiyaga avan vallamai nidathai nam maalvil pidithukolgiran and immediately brings you and me under accusation ungale menne udanadiyaga kutram saatigiravana irupan he will immediately weaken our spiritual life udanadiyaga nammudi aavikuriya vaalkai avan balavina paduthigiravana irupan and you know this is true idhu satyam enna namakku theriyum you have experience that i have experience ningalum nanum adai unarndirukrom anubavithirukrom yes so brothers and sisters there's a great need to apprehend by faith the power and potential of this blood agave inda rathathinudaiya vallamiyum adinudaiya aatralayum naam pidithukolla vendiyathu viswasathinaale migavum avashyamaa irukirathu endrai paarkrom and appropriating and by faith in my life adu mathramalla viswasathinaale idai naam nam maalvil nadaimurai padatha vendum as we come into these end times nam inda mudivu kaalathile naam varigira velai as we come into these end times nam mudivu kaalathile vandu vittom andha velaiyile this is the day of the fulfillment of the day of atonement idhan andha paava nivirthi naalinudaiya niraivinal and the people must move into this realm inda mandalathirkku janangal munnera vendum that the accuser will have no place in their lives avude vaalkaiyile kutram saatukiravanukku endha oru edavum irukka koodadhu yes but stand continuously ana thorandu nirkka vendum in the efficacy of that blood and the rathathinudaiya vallaminal nirkka vendum stand continuously in your receiving by faith of all that jesus is made unto you from god ungalukkaga kristuvanavar edar eppadiyaga kodukkapattaro adu ellavattrayum perigiravulaga neenga kaanapala vendum yes receiving by faith vishwasathinaale petrukonde all that jesus is made unto you from god devan kristuve ungalku edarkaga koduthirkaro ellavattrayum neengal petrukonde ullaga maara vendum no no all that jesus christ has been made unto you from god parameshwar ko dwara prabhu yeshu masi ko devanal namakku kristuvanavar हमारे लिए क्या बनाया गया इन्ने कार्य तो कि इन्ने लेट्स जस्ट टर्न टू दैट स्क्रिप्ट आशीर्वाद अंगल को लेकर पटेल के आरो आदि ये लोग फर्स्ट कोरिंथियन चैप्टर वन एंड वर्स थर्टी वन कोरिंथियन वन ना मध्य कारण मुप्पदा मसनम बट ऑफ हिम आर ही इन क्राइस्ट जीसस हु ऑफ गॉड इज मेड अंटू यू अंटू अस विस्डम 
and righteousness and satisfaction and sanctification and redemption avare devanal namakku gnanamum neediyum parisuthamum meetpum aanar who is made unto us avare devanal namakku of god is made unto us devanal namakku avar undaakapattar kodukapattar ha yeah read verse 30 brother avare devanal namakku avare devanal namakku gnanamum neediyum parisuthamum meetpumana yes so this is what jesus was made unto us from god idhan devanal yesu christu namakku kodukapattirukkar he has made unto us wisdom avar namakku gnanamai kodukapattirukkar and righteousness neediyai kodukapattirukkar and sanctification parishuddhamai kodukapattirukkar and redemption meetpanavarai irukkar oh this is one thing we must accept indha or karyathai nam yetukolla vendum yes we must continuously stand on this ground nam thodarnde indha athibarathil nirkka vendum that he is made unto me unto us from god avar namakku deva gnanamai irukkar redemption and sanctification and holiness and and righteousness and so on and wisdom kristu vanavare devanal namakku kodukapatta neediyayum parishuddhamayum meetpumayum irukkar he is made unto us avar namakkaga kodukapatta so it is not a mental knowledge agave idu arivu saarna puridhal alla you know we need a revelation agave namakku oru velippaadu avasiyam an enlightening by the spirit of god avin moolamaga oru puridhal avasiyam you know i know these scriptures i know it from my early days enudi aaramba kaalathil irundhe christ is made unto me wisdom enakku christu vanavar it's one thing to say that it's another thing to apprehend it indha oru kaaryathai nam solvadhu oru kaaryam and appropriate it by faith by the help of the holy spirit anal aavin moolamaga viswasathin moolamaga pidithukolvadum nadaimiraipaduvadum vera oru kaaryamaga irukkirathu and when we do that anal adhai nam seiyum bolude we will be able to clear up everything ella vidha kaaryathaiyum nam thudai theduthu viduvom when the holy spirit convicts us of things aaviyanavar kaaryangalai namak unarthum bolude no no when the holy spirit convicts us of certain things in our life namude valile aaviyanavar sila kaaryangalai unarthum bolude you know we will be able to clear up those things and the kaaryangalai nam thudaithu vida mudiyum you know those weaknesses and the balavinangalai those failures and the tholvigalai you know those shortcomings and the koraibaadugalai you know we are able to clear up those things and between god and us namakkum devanukkum idaiyile kanapidigira ivigal ellam nam thudaithu kaluvi vidamudi by virtue of the blood of christ yesu christu vendathathin moolamaga you know this is important idhu miga mukkiyamagum christ is made unto me sanctification christ enakku parishuddhamaanar and the things that i see within enakkullaga kanapidigira kaaryangal the things that i see within enakkullaga kanapidigira kaaryangal i am able to take the authority of the blood and receive that cleansing and clear them up in my life and the yesu christ in the earth there is a vallam in the authority i am able to take and i can clear the things that i see within and clear them up oh may god help us to see this brothers and sisters 1 john in chapter 1 once again one yovan one amadigaram marubadiyamaga vasikkalam you know If we say verse 8 etam vasanam verse 7 and 8 and 9 we will read 7 8 9 we walk in the light as he is in the light we have fellowship with one another and the blood of Jesus Christ his son cleanses us from all sin avar olil irukkadha pole nam olil nadandal oru 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 aikkapattirupom avade kumaranaga yesu christuvin ratham sagala paavangalaiyum nikki namai suthikarikkum if we say that we have no sin we deceive ourselves namakku paavam illa enbomanal namai namai vanjikiravala irpom and the truth is not in sathyam namakku irade if we confess our sins namude paavangalai nam arikkittal he is faithful and just to forgive us our sins paavangalai namakku mannithe ella aniyayathiyum neeki namai suthikaripadarkku avar unmayum neediyum cleanses from all unrighteousness unmayum neediyum ullavara irukkar from all unrighteousness ella aneediyum aniyayathiyum mannipadarkku avar unmayullavara irukkar so what is that mean adhu idhu artham enna we have heard this word before idhai nam kettirukkrom idharkku munbu you know how important it is to clear up things ella kaaryangalaiyum thudaithu viduvathu evvalavu mukkiyam concerning which the holy spirit 
speaks in conviction aadiyanavar namakku unartum bolude idu seiya vendiyathu mikka avasiyam clear it up in the virtue of that blood and yesu christ in rathathil irukkira vallamainal nam adu seiya mudiyum that the enemy is ruled out ange satruvanavan edukapadugiran this is what john is saying here idhaan inga yohan solugira hallelujah amen amen this is what john is saying idhaan yohan solugira clear up that adhai neengal kalivi vidungal thudaithu vidungal clear up that adhai neengal eduthu vidungal kalaindu vidungal in the conscious realm ungalude unarvin mandalathil irundhu in the known realm ariyapatta mandalathil irundhu yes when the holy spirit brings to us conviction namak aaviyanavar unarthadalai tharum bolude how important it is to clear up those things and the kaaryangalai kalaindu poduvathu miga avasiyamai irukkirathu that we would experience that he is my sanctification avare enude parishuddham endru nam anubavikka mudiyum he is my redemption avare enude meetpanavar it is his blood that covers me avare ratham dhaan ennai moodugirathu satan accuser will have no power over our life nammude vaalvikkin melaga andha satanana kutram chaatukiravanukku adhigaram illai this is very important we need the apprehending of this by faith and an appropriating it by faith in our lives in these in the naal kalil nammude vaalkile indha kaaryangal viswasathinal pidikapada vendum viswasathinal nadaimurai padatha vendum endru solugiren you know this is very important idhu miga mukkiyamagum holy is may holy spirit open our eyes of understanding today indum kuda devan nammude puridalin kankalai therakattum you know not a mental knowledge edho arivu saarnda puridal alla not a religious understanding edho madha prakaramana puridal alla not a theological understanding edho thirumarai kalviyin puridal alla but we need a light as abraham abraham e pole namakku oru velicham thevai as the lord said to the disciples and open their understanding yesu vanavar thande seesargalude kangalai therandare adhe pole therakapada vendum yes you know now we see how often you know the enemy keeps us in the place of bondage through his accusation namakku theriyum ediriyanavan thande kutrachaattin moolamaga nammai eppadi adimiyaga veithirukkiran you know satanic tyranny or satanic oppression and the satan udaiya odukudalai nam paarkrom is through self occupation nammudaiya suya anudhaapathin moolamaga you know when you are occupied with self neengal suyathinal anudhaapapattukondirukkum bolude you come under the oppression of satan neengal satan a market satan udaiya odukathile neengal vandu vilugireergal enbadai kavanithukollungal yes and we can only be broken and brought out of that by a right apprehension of the power of the blood of christ yesu christuvinudaiya and the rathathin vallamainudaiya sariyana nadaimurai paduthadil moolamaga maatrame neengal adirundhu velindhu veliya vendu vidudal adaiya mudiyum many of us were moving on into the heights in christ nammil anegar christuvinudaiya veerathukku vandu kondirukkrom I see that many of us come under the great accusation of the enemy. அப்படியே வரும்பொழுது குற்றச்சாட்டுகளுடைய பாதிப்பிலே நாம் अनेகர் வருகிறதை நான் பார்க்கிறேன். Please understand and hear the Lord rightly. ஆகவே சரியாக புரிந்துகொண்டு தேவனை கேட்டுக்கொள்ளுங்கள். It's necessary for the Lord's people to get this right in their hearts. தேவனை ஜனங்கள் தங்களுடைய இதயத்திலே இதை சரியாக புரிந்துகொள்ள வேண்டும். There are so many of the Lord's people. They were generally anegar today. Indre, over the, over whom Satan is lording. Our little ke mail aga Satan na na one adhigaram chilti gram. Yes, yeah, lording it over them. Our little ke mail aga adhigaram chilti konde rikram. Yes, and lording it. on the line of accusation kutram saatikonde avargal melaga adhigaram selithikonde irukkiran yes yeah ha ah, dosh lagane ke dwara unka adheen mein le aate hai listen very carefully kono mai kelungal many many are being you know brought under this accusation of the enemy they are found bound there 
ஆகவே அநேகர் இந்த சத்திரனுடைய குற்றச்சாட்டின் கீழாக கொண்டு வரப்பட்டு அங்கே அவர்கள் அடிமைத்தனத்திலே கட்டி வைக்கப்பட்டிருக்கிறதை நான் பார்க்கிறேன் along the line of accusation and the kutram chaatthale avan thodandu sondikondirpadina bringing them under a sense of condemnation avargal thangale thangale avargal kutram chaatikollugirargal adan moolamaga bringing them under judgment avargal thangale thangale nyayapaduthikollugirargal robbing them of their joy avargalude sandoshathai avan kollai idugiran of their peace avargal samadhanathai ilakka cheygiran their assurance avargal nishchayathanmai tholaikka cheygiran their rest avargal yelaipaarudhal their hope அவருடைய நம்பிக்கையை துளத்தி விடுகிறான் தேவ ஜனங்களை தேவன் விடுதலை ஆக்கட்டும் there is no reason for god's overcomers to be there தேவனுடைய தேவாலிகள் அங்க இருக்க வேண்டிய அவசியமே இல்லை yes உண்மைதான் We don't have to come under the accusation of the enemy. அந்த எதினுடைய குற்றஞ்சாட்டுகள் கீழாக நாம் வர வேண்டிய அவசியம் இல்லை. Yes. Don't be caught up with self life. ஆகவே சுய அனுதாபத்தில் பிடிக்கப்பட வேண்டாம். Self occupation is very dangerous. சுய அனுதாபம் மிக ஆபத்தானது. Yes. Oh may God open our eyes of understanding. ஆகவே இதைக் குறித்து தேவன் நம்முடைய கண்களை திறக்கட்டும். Brings them under a sense of condemnation, judgment. Yes. அவர்களை தங்களை தாங்களாகவே கடிந்து கொள்ள செய்கிறான் ஒரு robbing them of their peace. அவருடைய சமாதானத்தை கலைத்து விடுகிறான். Robbing them of their joy. அவருடைய சந்தோஷத்தை இழக்க செய்கிறான். Their assurance. அவருடைய நிச்சயத்தை தொலைக்க செய்கிறான். their rest avudi yai paarthale eduthu vidugiran avudi nambikai thooki vidugiran he is an accuser avan kutram saatukiravan accusing you day and night before god devanukku munbaga iravum pagalum ungalai kutram saatukiravan aagi irukkiran yes now ippolude Please look at your own spiritual life. உங்களுடைய ஆவிக்குரிய வாழ்க்கையை நீங்கள் ஆராய்ந்து பாருங்கள். Are you always talking about your shortcomings? உங்களுடைய குறைபாடுகளை எப்பொழுதுமே பேசிக் கொண்டிருக்கிறீர்களா இருக்கிறீர்களா? You will come under the oppression of the enemy. நீங்கள் சத்துருனுடைய ஒடுக்குதலுக்கு கீழ் வந்து விடுவீர்கள். going on into maturity coming into overcoming life separation from this world overcoming sin and self this is not a matter of condemnation agave paripurnathukku povade jeyam kolvade ningal jeyavaliyaga maarvade ulagathilirundhu pirippade idu ellam nammai naame kadindu kolugira It's not a matter of condemnation. It is cutting the bullet. It is not a matter. Yes. So we need to rightly understand what the spirit is saying. Alve, nam. ஆவின் காரியத்தை சரியாய் புரிந்து கொள்ள வேண்டும். For that what we need is not intellect what we need is an open spirit. இதற்கு நமக்கு அறிவு தேவை இல்லை ஆவியானவருடைய புரிதல் தேவை. Yes. self occupation is dangerous suyathai vaithukondu nondu poikondu vaalakoodadu adu aabathanadu there are many of god's people who are always caught up about their own shortcomings anega deva janangal thangude kurai vaalgalai kudithu migavum kavalai pettu kondirukkirargal their weakness avargal avargal balavinathe kurithu nondu poikondirukkirargal they are ever circling around themselves avargal thangale thangale sutri kondirukkirargal vattathile
and they are found where they do not want to be அவர்கள் விரும்பாத இடத்திலே அவர்கள் காணப்படுகிறார்கள் they are found where they do not want to be அவர்கள் விரும்பாத இடத்திலே அவர்கள் காணப்படுகிறார்கள் yes and they miss out where they ought to be அவர்கள் எங்க இருக்க வேண்டும் அதை இழந்து கொண்டிருக்கிறார்கள் yes and they are not what they ought to be அவர்கள் எப்படி இருக்க வேண்டுமோ அப்படி இருக்கவும் இல்லை they are not what they ought to be அவர்கள் எப்படி இருக்க வேண்டுமோ அப்படி இருக்கவில்லை yes dear brothers and sisters எனக்கு பிரியமான தேவஜனங்களே we need such people need deliverance from satan அப்படிப்பட்டவர்கள் oppression சாத்தானின் ஒடுக்கத்திலிருந்து விடுதலை தேவை they should have a fresh apprehension of the absolute satisfaction of the father in his son on our behalf namakku badilaga kumaranaanavar devanudaiya and dhiruptiyaga paliyadapattar enbadhu that god is satisfied in and through the life and the blood of his son on our behalf devan thanudaiya kumaranudaiya vaalkeyilum avudaiya and rathathilum paripurnamaga sandosham alaiyar enbadhai naam arindu unara vendum yes the acceptance of our life is not in ourselves but in the son devan namai yetrukondathu nammil alla nammulamaga alla devanal dev kristuvinal now listen very carefully kumaranal let me put it a little more clear to us idai naan thelivaga solugiren you know many a time pala velagalile i want to ask you personally ungalukku thanipatta vidathil kekkiren You know, don't you see the enemy many a time bringing those sins which God has already forgiven you? They even umgalak yer kanave manni thanda pavate palamure sathuru mana man kundu varu thei ningal parikira dilla ya? How often the enemy brings that? Yevalu vadi ke magade avan kundu varigiran into parindal. And many a time, palam vele gali le. When I spend time with God's children, they even jarang orko na neeram thalavali kumbole. I have come across this. They even karandu vandir kire. Though the Lord has forgiven, they even thei manni thirunda alum. they have confessed to the lord they have come to arik thedirndalum we see that those things are still alive in their lives avade vaalkile innum avigal uyirod irukirade paarkiren why yen and brings you into a self occupation on those things which god has already forgiven and forgotten and cleansed devan mannithu marandu கழிவி அந்த காரியங்கள் உங்களுக்கு மறுபடியுமாக ஒரு நொந்து போகிற அனுபவத்தை கொடுக்கிறதே ஏனது குற்றம் சாட்டுகிறவன் கடந்த காலத்தை கொண்டு வருவான் அங்குதான் நாம் ரத்தத்தினுடைய வல்லமை நமக்கு தேவை as we heard a while back people the kettu pole if you have clear up everything that the holy spirit has brought into your conviction they are clear they are removed as far as east is far from west in your life aviyanavar namakku unarthukira karyangalai nam paavu arikai seidhu nam kalivi viduvomanal avigal kilakkukkum merukkukkum evalavu dooramaga irukkiradho avalavu dooramaga devan thalli viduvar yes so dear brothers and sisters agave deva janangale self occupation is a dangerous thing suya anudavam suyathai kurithu nondu povadal aavathana oru kaaryam yes. that is why agave the book of 1 john chapter 1 is very very important for us in our day to day present life nammudaiya anudina tharkala vaalkaiki 1 yovan 1 amadhigara miga miga mukkiyamaga irukirathu let me just read that again everybody man idai vaasikire Yes. 1 John chapter 1. 1 Yohann 1st chapter. Yes. Yes. If we say that we have no sin, we deceive ourselves. நமக்கு பாவம் இல்லை என்போமானால் நம்மை நாமே வஞ்சிக்கிறவர்களாக இருப்போம். And the truth is not in us. சத்தியம் நமக்குள் இராது. If we confess our sins, நம்முடைய பாவங்களை அறிக்கை செய்தால் He is faithful and just to forgive us our sins and to cleanse us from all unrighteousness paavangalai namakku mannithu ella aniyayathaiyum neeki namme suthikarippadharku avar unmaiyum neediyum ullavaraiyirukkar 8 9 vasanangal amen 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 
this is the ground we have to maintain you know so we see him many a time i've seen this how the enemy brings the past Remember when God brings the past to us. You know one thing. Your heart will be flooded with gratitude towards God. You know when God ever brings your past. You know he doesn't bring the past to condemn us. To be in a self-occupation. But he brings the past to us. To show his mercies over our lives. How he has forgiven us. How he has shown his love towards us. And your heart will be filled with gratitude. But when the enemy brings the past to you. He brings you to condemnation. You are good for nothing. You will never make it. You don't think you are going to be in this, in this fellowship. You are never going to be an overcomer. You will never be part of the glorious God. It is not like that. God will never say like that. It's not that God is going to condone sin in our lives. No. Condone means allow to live in sin. Yes. That's not what he's going to do. Look at the woman who was caught in the act of adultery. What did he say? Neither do I condemn you. Go and sin no more. If, if any man sin, as John says here. Yes, let's just turn to that scripture again. Yes, may the Holy Spirit open our eyes of understanding. Yes. You know, it says here. You know, in the same breath as we read this, if we say that we have no sin, we deceive ourselves and the truth is not in us. Yes. But if we sin, but, but if we confess our sins, He is faithful and just to forgive us our sins and to cleanse us from all unrighteousness. He becomes our righteousness. But we must confess. We must repent. And then He says, if we say that we have not sinned, we make him a liar and his word is not in us. Chapter 2 and verse 1. My little children, these things write I unto you that you sin not. But as many as are called of the Lord, but, and if any man sin, we have an advocate with the Father, Jesus Christ the righteous. He is the propitiation of our sins. And not for ours only but also for the sins of the whole world. Now it goes on. What I am trying to say here is, The Apostle John makes it very clear to us. That God doesn't want us to be in self-occupation. And if any man. It's not that we have no hope in our life. We still have an advocate. But the mind of God is that. I write these things unto you that you sin not. That's the mind of God. Amen. Amen. That is the mind of God. The overcomer must appropriate this by faith and apprehend it by faith. Hallelujah. So when God brings us and, sh and, and tells us of certain things of the past, He only tells us to, to show us 
His love, His his mercies, His forgiveness that are that floods our hearts with gratitude, praises that we do not indulge and live in those things anymore. Apriyaka naam. போகிறோம்ரிசுத்திலிருந்து <laughs> போகிறோம் <laughs> He that is holy let him be holy still this is the way Parichuthamullavan innum parichuthamagattum ipdi than Oh may god help us Devanam kodai seyattum but self occupation Anal suya anudhabamo I am not good Naan onrukkum illai There is no good in me Enakku nanmai illai I do not know why I am like this Yen ipdi irukkena enakku theriyadhu I want to tell you He will he will oppress you with that Andha satruvanavan ungalai odukkuvan ipdi sonna You will be bound in his chains Avrudeya sangalil neengal katta I want to tell you God want to set some of us free today Ittum kuda deva janangalai devan vidudhalaiyaaga virumbugira Yes Hallelujah Oh may God help Devan namukku devi seyattum Yes The deliverance from satanic oppression is for you and for me and may we appropriate it by faith and apprehend it by faith viswasathin moolamaga naam pidikapaduvom viswasathin moolamaga nadaimarippaduthuvom satanudeya anda odukathilirundhu devan nammai vidudhale seigira neram vandu vittathu that is the way to cast out avane keela thalugira vali idhu dhaan that is the way to cast out the accuser anda kutram saatukira avane keela thalugira vali idhu dhaan yes this is the way of overcoming him even the accuser ipdi than kutram saatukiravane nam jeyam kolla mudiyum the dis, the defeat of satan satanudeya and the total and the victory of the overcomers and the devalinudeya jeyam is never by their efforts adu avarudeya meerkil alla it is not by their straining avargaludeya and the meerkil alla it is not by their groan avargaludeya and the tavippilum alla not anything they can do avargal seigira mudinda karyathilum alla it is the measure of their faith's appropriation avargaludeya vishwasathinudeya nadaimurai of the absolute perfection of christ and the muttilumana yesu christudeya paripurnam pin vallamai dhaan as a living working principle of god தேவனுடைய நியதிகள் உயிரோட்டமாக கிரிய செய்வதின் மூலமாக நமக்கு பதிலாக இட் இஸ் கிறிஸ்தவனுடைய முழுமையான பரிபூர்ணம் தான் நமக்கு ஜெயத்தை தருகிறது அவர் நம்மை மன்னிக்கும் பொழுது அவர் நம்மை பரிசுத்தப்படுத்தியிருக்கிறார் மேலாக சத்துணு இடத்தில் அதிகாரமே இல்லை the faith's appropriation and the viswasathinudeya nadaimurai and apprehension viswasathinal pidikapadu which is necessary today in our nammude vaalkile megapriya thevaiya irukirathu well other i have passed the time enudeya go over the time but and i have to close today agave neram kadandu poi vitten but it's my prayer agave naan jebikiren it's not a mental understanding that will save us agave nammai rachippadu arivu saarna puridhal god open their dark and understanding and their lives were changed sister mudiya and the irulin manade devan thirandar avargalai vaalkai maari vittu open their eyes avargalai kangalai devan thirandar sister ni kangalai devan thirandar avargalai vaalkai maari vittathu look at the life of abraham as we saw abraham in vaalkai paarungal revelation has got a striking you know work in our lives apdiya kanda velipadu namakku megapriya aachiryam ootum or kriyai nadapikkirathu you know so we need that agave namakku adu thevai you know even concerning the blood of christ even nam yesu christ athathai portha varai the cleansing work of christ yesu christ nude kaluvudalin kriyai portha varai illai you know these things we need not a mental understanding ivegal logical understanding ivegal ellam pagatha technical understanding 
but we need an illumination agave idhigale nam tholinutpa reethiyagavo oru pagatharivil moolamagavo arivu saarndha poyudalo alla namakku oru prakasham thevai yes oh may god deliver us from the satanic oppression that many a time god's people go through in their lives agave deva janangal pala murai pala velaigalile satanudeya odukkudalile poi kondirukiradilirund namakku vidudhai avashyam oh may god help us to come into that place of appropriating by faith and apprehending by faith that the lord jesus christ his spotless lamb of god and that blood will be sufficient for me against everything the enemy will bring against me agave yesu christuvinude ratham and the maatra ratham and the mulumiyana vallamaiy konda ratham enakku podumanadhu என்று நான் விசுவாசத்தினால் பிடிக்கப்பட்டு விசுவாசத்தினால் நடைமுறைப்படுத்தி வாழும் பொழுது நான் சத்துருவை ஜெயம் கொள்வேன் நான் ஜெயவாளியாக இருப்பேன் சுயத்தை ஜெயம் கொள்கிற வல்லமை அங்க இருக்கிறது we have to appropriate by faith அதை நாம் விசுவாசத்தினால் நாம் நடைமுறைப்படுத்த வேண்டும் we have to apprehend it by விசுவாசத்தினால் பிடித்து கொள்ள வேண்டும் yes so this our life is going to be according to the measure of faith's appropriation of this truth ஆகவே இந்த சத்தியத்தை எவ்வளவு விசுவாசத்தினால் நடைமுறைப்படுத்துகிறோமோ அவ்வளவுாக நாம் ஆவிக்குரிய வாழ்க்கையை living in a working way in our lives ஒரு ஜீவனுள்ள வழியில் அது கிரியை செய்கிறது yes and i want to tell you in close agave nerivile solugiren it is to be a great thing it is a great thing to be in christ kristuvukullaga vaalvathu megapariya oru kaaryam as paul says paul solugira that i may be found in him avarkul naan kaanapada vendum endru solugira that i may be found in him avarkul naan kaanapada vendum to be found in christ kristuvukul kaanapaduvathu to be in, to be to be in christ jesus christuvil kaanapaduvathu is a great thing in one's life avarude vaalkile migapriya oru kaaryam that's what paul desired even towards the end of his life avudeya kadaisi kaalathilum kuda paul idaye vaanjithar amen in philippians chapter 3 where he says philippians that i may be found in him avarile na kaanapada vendum endru philippians 3 amadhi kaaryam it's a great thing to be found in christ christuvukul kaanapaduvathu migapriya kaaryam and we need a right understanding by the holy spirit in our life nammude vaalkaiyile aaviyin moolamaga sariyana purigalai pera vendum so dear brothers and sisters may this be a day where we'll experience a kind of deliverance in our own lives by the blood by the appropriating by faith the blood appropriating by faith agave yesu apprehending by yesu christuvin rathathai viswasathin moolamaga pidithukolvadhin moolamum nadaimurai paduthuvadhin moolamum nammude vaalkaiyile oru vidudhalai anubhavippom indha naalkalile yes let's come into the knowledge of this by the holy spirit in the arivirkku aavin moolamaga naam kadandu varuvom remember though today we conclude the message here inga naam seediye mudithalum indru god will continue to speak to devan thondu nammodu kuda pesuvar the message today is not the end indriya seedi idodu mudindu vidadu you know god will continue to unfold devan thondu namakku therandu kaanpa his mind and his thought avrude sindhai avrude nilaivugalai kaanpipar let's be open to whatever god has helped us to see in today indre devan namakku therandu kaanpitta kaariyathirkku naam therandu kaanapaduvom avrude prasanathil irundhu kaanapaduvom and may the lord help us to come into the good of the word that we have received today indre naam petra vasanathinudaiya nanmaikku naam kadandu vara devan namakku udhavi seiyum thank you jesus hallelujah hallelujah Thank you Lord
Oh, let's come into the appropriation of that blood of Christ and fulfillment of the Day of Atonement, the seventh month, the full potential. Come into an apprehension by faith and appropriation by faith. Thank you, Jesus. May God deliver us from self-occupation where the accuser is very active. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. May God set us free from that. Thank you, Lord Jesus. The Lord doesn't condemn us. The Holy Spirit never condemns us. He always convicts us of sin. But never condemns us. Thank you, Jesus. God help us to clear up that the accuser will have no place. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah, Lord Jesus. We need a Holy Spirit imparted revelation today of what we heard. Pray to God, Lord, open my spiritual eyes. Lord, I heard about your blood. What I need is not a mental understanding, but I need a revelation of what that blood and the power of that blood. Yes, Lord. To appropriate it and to apprehend it by the Spirit Lord. That's my need. How often I have been under condemnation. How often Lord I have been under the accusers. Power. As Joshua the high priest. Standing at the right hand. Having authority over our lives, Lord. Be honest to confess to Him. How often we have been in that place of self-occupation. The enemy coming over and over again, condemning us. Over those things that God has forgiven and cleansed us. Dragging us to a place. You're good for nothing. You're doing the same thing. How long? May we break out of that chain by the power of the blood of Christ. He is made unto you redemption. He is made unto you righteousness. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. The overcomer Does not live in the place of condemnation. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Thank you, Lord. May God help us, therefore. Thank you, Jesus. That revelation of the Lord and His purpose will make you a man who cannot interpret what you go through, your situations, to the people of the world. Hallelujah. But you have one assurance. You are pursuing a call. You are pursuing a purpose. Not something conceived in yourself. Nor in any man. But that one assurance in the life of Abraham was. It was God. It was God. It was God. Let us stop convincing ourselves. And convincing the world. We do not convince ourselves. Our conviction is of the Holy Spirit. Hallelujah. May God help us. Heavenly Father, we thank you for today. We thank you for this time in your presence, O God. We thank you for this great call that is resting upon us. You have saved us with a great purpose, O God. That great salvation is on the horizon of our lives, Lord. Living in these end times, we are privileged to experience 
The glory that shall come upon your church. Just as the early disciples and saints had the privilege of the glory of its beginning. The end time church will have the glory of its consummation of all things. Oh God, help us to know this and live in the light of it, Lord. Live in the joy of it. Lord, many a time, Lord, thy children were moving on into those heights, come under the accusation. We are found in a self occupation. Lord, deliver us today from the every accusation of the enemy. Help us to arise in the power of your blood. Clear up everything between. Lord, that would, the Holy Spirit will convict us today, Lord. When you remind us, when you bring us to memory the things of the past, Lord, you do not do that in order to condemn us, but always to show us your love, your grace, your mercies, that our hearts may flood with joy. Our hearts may flood with gratitude, praises to the one who has forgiven us and cleansed us. That we do not sin anymore. We do not walk in that path anymore. It may bring restraints to us, Lord. But the enemy, every time accuses us. And accuses us before you as well. But Lord, you never accept those accusations. But how often we accept those accusations and remain in bondage. If you do not accept that accusation, why should we accept it, Lord? Forgive us. Forgive us, Lord. You have accepted us in your son. You have trusted us when we trusted him for an overcoming life. You trusted, Lord, when we said, Lord, we will move on into this fullness in Christ Jesus. Not in our strength. Because you have opened our eyes that there is a full salvation. Therefore, we believed, Lord, not because we can reach there, but because you are destined your church to be there. And therefore, you will accept us in your son. Though we are weak today, but we shall not remain weak, O oh God. We will move on from strength to strength, from faith to faith, from glory to glory, until we appear in Zion. O Ramakaya Kashaka Tele Ramakaya. Your church will, O oh God. Your people will, O oh God. They will not be under the tyranny and its oppression of Satan anymore, O oh God. Oh Lord, we pray that Lord, thy people will arise, O oh God, today. Come out of bondage and accusation and oppression of the enemy, O oh God. Walk out in liberty. Chains may fall off, O oh God. Therefore, there is no condemnation to them who are in Christ Jesus. We walk out of the Spirit. Hallelujah. Lord, we pray. Lord, we pray, Lord, we pray that we would appropriate by faith and apprehend by faith of God, even with the help of the Holy Spirit, thy word. Experience the power of it. Lord, the world can never judge us because they do not understand us. Lord, our life is outside. Open our eyes to see that in the coming days, Lord. It's our prayer. The principle that worked in Abraham may work in us, Lord. You're moving, you're working in the servant of thine. It's a principle of your working in your remnant as well. So we bring our lives to you once again, Father. Continue to work in us. Continue to work in us, Lord. Continue to work in your church, in your people. We give you the glory. We give you the praise. 
Yes, Lord. We thank you for your word. Let it be a light. Holy Spirit, let it be a light unto all of us. It's our prayer as we submit our petition before thee. Heavenly Father, hear us and answer us. For in Jesus' most precious and matchless name we pray.